Hello, everyone. Welcome to my channel. This reading today is going to be what is next in your career. So we have two piles. This is pile one. This brown bracelet. This is pile two. This colorful brace bracelet. Hopefully you can hear me very well. We're gonna get started in your readings. All right, so I'll see you at your time stamps. We chose this bracelet. This is your reading. What is next in your career? Let's see. What is next in Paul One's career? The world card is here. Something about this bull. I feel like something with your money. What's next in your career? Is it increase in your money or some type of transformation in your money where you realize a better way of spending your money, a better way of budgeting, a better way of going about your money, power one. Maybe the next change in your career is you getting some help with your money or advice, because I'm seeing a financial advisor, an accountant, somebody, a second pair of eyes is coming on your money. Paul one. The next step in your career is somebody looking at your money for some reason. Maybe because you've been manifesting a lot, this magician card is in reverse. Or you then you haven't manifested in a little bit and it's kind of a dry spell right now. I see you changing a different form of transportation to get to your job better. So you may be taking the bus more often or walking more often or you're going to be driving. However it resonates, you're going to be changing the way you get to your job very soon. I see you searching the web, going on a global search, Paul, one. You're going on a global search to find success, to gain success. I see you on the internet looking up something. You're learning more about you're learning more about your career on the internet, trying to understand it more, understand different perspectives of it. I'm also seeing the foreign exchange market. So you could be a trader or know someone who's a trader or want to get into stocks and trading, that type of thing. Chat GPT, something about that as well. You could be working to become a, a virtual assistant. It's like side hustle energy. I see you searching the web learning more about your career, learning more about your hobby so that you can expand it and make it into a foundation, something you can go home to is what I'm saying, enough for you to bring home and take care of yourself. A lot of wands energy, you could be a masculine, or just someone who's in their masculine energy a lot. Um, and you, res you respond to things very quickly. So I see you getting some type of message and you responding very quickly. News opportunity will be handed to you very soon. What else? Four of Wands in reverse. No time to think about it, for real. It's just, you already know what you want, Paul. One, you already know what you want. I see here that your career could be something unconventional. It could be something different. It's like the opposite side of a coin or something. King of Wands here on the bottom here. 
It's like, how do I describe this? Your career is changing pace. Okay. You were doing something, working in a field that was very hustle and bustle. Okay. And now you're changing your career to be in the energy of the King of Cups. Emotional, vulnerable, intuitive even. Yeah, you're working with people in a different way, Paul One. You're going to be working with people in a different way. You're going to be working with people on an emotional level. You're going to be working with people on a, yeah, emotional level. Something else comes with water. You could be dealing with people's weight, um, traumas, something very much heavier than what you were used to working with when it comes to your career. It's not it's going to be as lighthearted, like humorous, funny, joking around, that type of energy. It's going to come to things that are more serious. So you know what that means for you, Paul. One. And then through your swords here. Your career is changing, is going through a metamorphosis because you were, you came to an end of a cycle with the world card and you have stopped creating energy or stopped feeling creative or felt like a block or you've been, and then for another part of you, you've been creating a lot. So a second person has come in to look at your finances and help you with them. And then for the other group of you, since it's block, um, you block energy has been here for a little bit. You've been searching the web on how to get better at whatever your hobby is, whatever it interests you. Looking at the internet for inspiration on what you want to do next, or trying to maybe even grow your platform on the internet, expand, connect to people on the internet to make money through the internet so that you can bring enough money home, okay? And with doing that, with three of wands here, four swords in reverse, I feel that you will have success in this in some degree and then an opportunity will arise and you'll respond to it very quickly. King of wands in reverse, you respond to it not even thinking about it too much. Um, it's going to be an immediate yes for you. And you know it's not going to be as lighthearted as it once was with this King of Wands in reverse. But it's something that you feel like move you forward in the way that resonates with you. It's healing you as well, this new opportunity in your career, dealing with the emotional side of people or emotional side of you, however it may resonate. This is general. Um, yeah. And this could be in relation to, like, helping people... Um, work less or come out of bad jobs that aren't good for them or bad jobs that are emotionally draining to them. You could be transitioning to someone who talks to people, helps them get courage, like a success coach, something of that nature. Someone who just speaks a lot about their journey or their past and sharing it with the world on the internet about how to leave a job and still be stable. All right, that's for some of you, like one person at least. All right, so that was your reading, Paul One. I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, 
please like, comment, and or subscribe. Hit the red button down below. And if you want to support my content, check out my Amazon wish list and see what's going on there. All right. So I'll see you in another reading. Bye, Paul. Hello, Paul 2. If you chose this colorful bracelet, this is your reading. What is next in your career? All right. So what I'll have. Paul 2, I see you are cleaning up something. Um, residue. Okay, yeah. So page of wands. There's a lot of page energy. So I see you making a lot of connections, talking to people, connecting with people. You're trying to go from a page to a knight to a queen, king, whatever you may resonate with. But you're in a young phase right now, maybe a startup business or startup at the bottom of a corporation. You may be an intern somewhere. So this is what I'm seeing. You're, you are in an intern energy or you're in a startup energy and you're trying to clean up the foundation. Or you may need to clean up the foundation because, yeah, get really focused. So, yeah, you, you, you're in the startup foundation realm right now with your career. And getting focused is where your energy is, where it's at, your attention is at. Okay, focusing on safety, security. Red is popping out in these cards here. Um, and red is the root chakra. So yeah, safety, security. Um, so that you can feel creative later on. I see you going inward, studying things that you've already tried, things that didn't work. Okay, trial and error. So you're mastering right now the formula for your success. And this could keep you up at night thinking about it. Like, why aren't you seeing any results? That type of vibe. And it may give you anxiety. Just really worried about it because you want this to be something you can rely on. And you want this to be your destiny. All to Queen of Swords here. You making sure that you're honest with yourself. Logical in the process. We'll help you out of this Nine of Wands energy. Feeling like You kind of just get in rough housed out there, okay? This is the practice for you, Paul, too. You're in a practice learning mode in your career right now. So you're you're taking notes, you're watching, you're communicating, talking to people, asking questions, asking lots of questions, in fact, um, and seeing how you can improve the career field you're in, you can improve the systems that there so that you can grow and level up in a sense and see results in your career field. It's been like whatever career field it is, it's, you're in, it's important for you to communicate, talk. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking, I'm just looking at the cards to, to confirm or get some indicators get some deeper messages here um they're basically just saying the same thing i just said yes so with the two of wands it in reverse it also talks about an unreliable partner so you could be in communication with somebody who's not making you feel like they are doing 
the best work they can do or just isn't the best fit in whatever money opportunities y'all are planning together or want to attempt together. This person could be in this energy right now. Uh, they could be worried about something, feeling depressed about a woman at home or they could feel like their boss has been a little too honest with them. So that's why they kind of been an unreliable business partner, if you can get what I'm saying. Or and then for some of you, this could be you feeling worried, depressed, um, anxious, because the person that you want to show up isn't showing up like the way you need them to. So you're in the energy of being independent, self-reliant, and honest with yourself and with your business, with whatever is your role in your career to make sure things get done, okay? Even though you feel like you've been through the ringer, like I'm seeing a boxer getting punched a bunch of times and them feeling like they want to give up, but they get back up and fight, okay? They continue on in the battle because they have a goal to get the gold you know even though they made some mistakes and been kind of irresponsible with their money or irresponsible with family um family expectations or what's expected of them it's just a, a lesson that they've been learning and moving through because the strength is on the bottom of the deck but it was kind of in reverse. So in your career, you're learning to be strong. You're learning to be independent, self-reliant. And moving through things, even though it's hard, even though it hurts, even. Um. yeah it's some good news on the other end of course with what coming in your, what's next in your career okay. so this business partner could be easily leaving or trying to find a way out of the contract somehow but you'll you'll be knowing soon, Paul. To you'll be knowing soon. What's next in Paul's future? But I'm gonna get Queen of Wands. Yeah, a glow up. So this is a transformation period for you, Paul. To um, a plutonic transformation for your career right now. All right. So I hope you enjoyed your reading call too. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the red button down there. Um, and check out my Amazon wish list to support my content. And I'll see you in another reading call too. Bye.